and welcome back to the adventures of Aleka, the Hoondings shield maiden. And uh, I've taken a little bit of time uh, since the last episode to, um, well, basically smith up some dwarven bows. And I've given some to our new follower here, and I've taken some on board myself. And uh, the next step will be to sell them. And then, yeah, we'll go to another part of the map that we, well, that Aleka hasn't been to before. So, but first, we have a level up, so let's do that. Of course, points into health, which we'll keep doing until we get to 200. We'll put a few more into stamina. Oh, we have a lot of levels to level up. Okay. Um, but yeah, mostly health is uh, what we're going for. We don't need magicka because we're not using spells. Um, we want to go for uh, this one. Ebony. That is our goal. So we need 13 more levels of smithing. But before we get there, uh, twice as much, no. Um, let's do this and do hard steel. And the next will be ebony. Uh, we can do, I want to do this, advanced workshop, but we don't need that yet. So let's keep two perk points for those perks that we want here. And uh, we may want this as well. All right, so we have a lot of training rights still. But we don't have a lot of money until we sell off these dwarven bows and make some more. So, heavy armor. It's definitely something we're gonna need to invest more in block. We want to get some rare perks in that and one handed. All right, but we're still doing business, so let's get to it. Uh, we want to sell off some more in a white run because we just made some dwarven bows. Um, we got the gift of charity from here, the little girl here in white run. Uh, we have the amulet of Zenithar and the blessing of the Bella from that shrine that we visited last time. So, thirty percent better prices or something. No, twenty percent better plus whatever this the difference in speech guild does yeah so let's see what do you have got some good pieces out here yeah Take a look. i mean in terms of money 5300 of course that is more because uh, i have a mod for that because otherwise you need to go to all the different sellers to sell off your stuff which is just mm, annoying Okay, and uh, we don't need any of that stuff, we just want to sell these. Okay, great. Don't um, forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. Yes. Where are you? My f new follower, Juras. Yeah, now you're running away. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, give me that stuff that you're carrying for me. Sure, let's trade. These. Okay. Oh, you could use better stuff as well. To the next fight. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, now I'm overloaded. Let's see how many you more she will take. Like I don't claim to be the best blacksmith in White Run. Yorland Greymane's got that honor. Mm. Man's steel is legendary. Oh. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. And I have about. 30 or so more at home. Hmm. What? No, 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 no. Are you crazy? I'm selling. Okay, I'm selling. And she can just about take that. Okay, great. 
Thanks for the business. Right. Then let's go for a ride. Is everybody coming? The whole team together. All right. And it's a beautiful day. Just early in the morning. When we first came to White Run, it was raining, but it cleared up. And here's my trusted horse, but we haven't been to Riften before. Need a ride? Yes. Where do you want to go? Riften, my dear. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Mm-hmm. Good. Well, there they are. If you've Come never on. Been to Riften, no. Be sure to visit the Black Briar Meadery. If you say so. And you'll forget all. Yeah, but we don't want to forget. Just please don't talk to us about alcohol. All right, here we are in Riften. We might as well do the speech check. Hold there. Yes. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitors tax. Right. What's the tax for? The privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? Well, that's obviously a shakedown. Keep your voice down. You want everyone to hear you? Yes. I'll let you in. Just let me unlock the gate. Do I need to let my dog have a go at you? Gates unlocked. Corrupt guards. Hmm. What else is new, eh? Um, so, do we need anything here? Not for real. The Thieves' Guild has Maven Blackbriar at her back. One snap of her fingers, and you could end up in Riften jail. New around Riften? Take my advice. Right. Yes. Don't have I just want to see if this guy has some dwarven metal ink. Come to see Balaman perform miracles with steel. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Right. Uh, yes, 13. Great. Uh, what else do you have? You're not selling any ebony. Uh, we still have plenty of iron, so we probably won't need more of that. Um, minor archery. Hmm. Okay. If you need any more smithing work, come see me again. Right. Um, we don't. Riften. The first thief that tries to steal my coin, I'm going to shove my mace down his throat. Hmm, well, that sounds no, like my kind of girl. Lose his nerve. Never uh. done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you carry. Hey, lass. Oh, yes, we're very honest. I'm saying you've got the coin. But you didn't earn a septum of it, honestly. I can tell. How could you possibly know that? It's all about sizing up your mark. Lines. Well, you size me up the wrong. The way they walk, what they're wearing. It's a dead giveaway. Mm, wealth is none of your business. Wealth is my business. But my wealth is like not taste. your business. No. I could take a hint, lass. You want to make some coin? Come find me. No, I have legal ways to make coin. You looking for something or what? What? No. Uh, I am looking for something, but nothing that you have to offer. Okay, let's go. All meats guaranteed, clean and free. Working at the Rift and Fishery is tough, but it puts some coin in my pocket. Mm -hmm. There is a special today on everything. Right. Just want to get past more because I'm not sure if I have the required speech level to pass his speech test. I probably do because I have, uh, yeah, 35. That should do it actually. Anyway, that's for next time. Um, oh, wait. <laughs> We can try and test that then. So I need to pick up that quest first. If we're going that way. Anyway, you probably know where I'm going. Hey, Mo. I don't know you. 
You and Riften looking for trouble? Nope. Just passing through. Yeah? Well, I got news for you. There's nothing to see here. Great. Last thing the Black Briars need is some stranger sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. That sounds ominous. Who are they? The Black Briars have Riften in their pocket, and the Thieves Guild watching their back. So mm -hmm. keep your nose out of their business. Yeah, 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 I'll try to keep my nose clean. I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. But it'll cost you. Mm-hmm. Dirt, eh? Then we're speaking the same language. Good. So what do you want to know? Uh, actually, nothing. Well, you got Maven. She pretty much runs the whole operation. She's got friends in high places, if you know what I mean. I know what you mean. Still not interested. Do we want any of this? Carrots, yes. Salt palm, yes. Alright. Let's go here and pick up this like fetch quest. Where are you? Oh, over there. This place has seen better days, but it's not my fault. All right, you've got your hands full, eh? I swear if I wasn't around, Elgrim would forget to eat his meals. How we make any coin at all is beyond me. Mm -hmm. In fact, I need to arrange for someone to pick up an ore sample for me in Shore Stone. Oh, goodness knows Elgrim won't lift a finger to do it. I could get it for you. You would? Mm hmm Oh, that would be wonderful. You are heading that way anyway. Speak to Filnyar in Shore Stone. He's got some sort of ore sample he wants us to identify and was willing to pay us well for it. Hmm. Interesting. Be careful. The road to Shore Stone could be dangerous. Hmm, it probably is. Sorry. Just Um, since we're here, we might as well salt pal, salt pal, uh, potatoes. Just the salt pal, please. All meats guaranteed, clean and free from rock joints. Cabbage. Oh, wow. Tomatoes. Cabbages. Lavender. Oh, no, we don't need lavender. And the ones on this side are marked as steel. No. The ones in front of houses mostly are down there. I mean those there. Anyway, potato. Oh, beef, great. And this is the reason. I've been looking for you. Oh my goodness. Got something I'm supposed yeah, to Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Falkreath and so on. Yeah. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Bye bye now. Um. Boom. Yes. Something's wrong with the physics there. Nope. Sorry. Nothing. Anyway, as I was trying to say, if you have the uh, unofficial patch, all this stuff is marked as steel. And they may think there's a good reason for that, but it's obvious that the game developers didn't really think that it should be, because it's like all over the place like that. Starting with um, Riverwood, if you play the game normally. If you're a new character, yeah, you want to pick up some goodies, like make some vegetable soup. Hey Fudge, it's a beautiful day, isn't it? Okay, let's go. Tools, wearables and weapons, mm. all for sale at new fair guys. prices. Yeah. So we're going to Shorestone, and there is a mine there that, again, if you don't have the unofficial patch, that mine has ebony ore veins. If you do have the unofficial patch, it doesn't. 
because they thought the game developers made a mistake for some reason and uh, they've switched it with another one like up the mountain somewhere there I just think that's annoying one of the many unnecessary changes by the unofficial patch yeah if I were an alchemist I would be picking up that canis root but we are not an alchemist at all the closest we get oh is making why do I not have my more equipped? Where are they? That's one. That's vigilance. You killed the other ones? Alright. Where's our friend? Our new friend, the orc. No. <sighs> The horse gets too close and I can't skin that wolf. We lost her, eh? Is it gonna be like this now? She can't keep up? Are there any more wolf bodies here? Here. That's vigilance, right? Who did that? Because, uh, yeah, we lost our friend, the orc. Hopefully she'll, um, what's that here? They just, wow, Vigilance, you're good. Who is this guy? This guy was almost killed by the wolf. Kyoli. I love the rift. Uh -huh. You don't get any of that ice water you get up north. Great. Sure, it rains from time to time, mm -hmm. but most days it's just an endless parade of pearls rocking gently to sleep, like a living lullaby. Well, that's, that's one way to look at it. You sound like an artist or a poet. Healthy on both counts. Although my wife is the true artist, the way the sight of her makes my knees buckle. Rain. Um... Did you come out here just to enjoy the fall forest? Yes, although my love worries it might be dangerous. Mm, it's really it wolves and bears licking these wolves. You just almost got killed by a wolf. Well, we can outrun the spriggans, avoid the bears, and appease the wolves. I figure I can just throw some meat on the ground and they'll fight each other for it. Of course, That's she says wheats don't make for a more appetizing meal. <laughs> mm. She got a point. Where's your wife now? She scampered off the shore stone to ask for directions. I assured her we need only follow the road, but she wants to be sure. She wanted to take a wagon, but I insisted we walk. I told her we're here to see the fall forest, so it would make no sense not to. I haven't told her the real reason we're here is to adopt a child. That part is a surprise. I see. You, you surprise your love and your earrings, not a child. You talk about that. I appreciate your concern, but it's not as if we haven't talked about it. She knows how I feel about children, and we can't have them on our own. Mm -hmm. All right, that's all the questions I have. Farewell to you, good traveler. Mm. May all your roads lead to warm sands. Farewell. There she is. My dear, I apologize. Where I is that wolf? The other wolf. I thought there was another one, but... Hmm, there. See? Hard to see in high grass. And for some reason, my horse, Fudge, this time did not go right on top of it. 
Do we want to hear more of them uh, speak to a warm sand? Uh huh. Visit a couple after they arrive in Riften. Okay. Can do. But before we do so, let's go here. I hope you haven't arrived here looking for work in the mine. Uh, well, I kind of did, but uh, I'm here for Elkrim's ore sample. It's about time. Hmm. I sent them a letter weeks ago. Ah, that Elgrim. He forget his own pants if his wife didn't help him dress. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> here you go. Tell half your that she can chip off whatever she thinks is a fair trade for their time. Good. Uh, what's wrong with the mine? <laughs> It's full of spiders. Oh That's my goodness. Sven would have loved that. And me when they showed up. Right. I'm worried that they'll come out of the mine looking for food soon. Then we're in even bigger trouble. Right. The town guards can't help you? Yeah, they're as useless as a fifth wheel on a wagon. Gave me some sort of line about keeping an eye out for enemy soldiers. Mm -hmm. What's the point in protecting this place if the mine's completely useless? Great. Um, I can try and clear them out for you. Tell you what, keep to your word, and I'll line your pockets with as much as I can scrape out. Great. All right. I don't want to be responsible for sending you to your death. Be careful in your mind. I will be. I will be. Vigilance, get out of my way. Alright, the mine is right around here, behind the smelter. There is a guard here, but they're pretty useless. And where is our... This one, we probably want this. Okay, there we go. No, one more is coming. Cool. Now oh, you jump down. Good dog. Alright. Sounds like that was it. Um, salt pile, cabbage, why not potatoes. Right. Lots of um, pickaxes around if you need one. But uh, we are used to bringing our own. So here we go. Getting the ebony ore with an amethyst, not bad. Together with the silver ingot, that makes a nice uh, ring. And you can sell this guy. Oh, and a lockpick, we'll take that. Uh huh, it was just this. Um, oh, yeah. I'll bet you two to one you find an orc down here somewhere. Three to one, he has his shirt off. <laughs> well, not this mine, because uh, if there was an orc here, he uh, would have killed all the spiders, wouldn't he? Okay, here's another one. Yeah, and I want to hit this one early on because, um, well, we're already leveling up quite a lot. And uh, it's hard to get to ebony ore at lower levels. I mean, it's not being sold by um, blacksmiths unless until you get to higher levels. So, if we want to smith up our own ebony armor, uh, we need to get enough ebony. And there aren't too many sources of that. I think that's it for this mine. Yep, that's it. 
and then there's a few pieces outside so we may need to come back here and mine it again after it respawns to get enough of it yeah here's a few pieces that is are free for the taking probably not if you have the unofficial patch but yes let's melt them down hmm so 15 but we need a bit more if we want to um, improve the stuff that we would make as well okay well yeah uh, let's go back to Riften and deliver that ore sample Get some freebies. Got a pretty full stock of potions and alchemy reagents. I know, I know, I know. Have you managed to make it out to Shore's Stone? I just came back from there, actually, and I brought you to your sample. Thank you. I'll be sure to get Elgrim to examine this as soon as his <clears throat> busy schedule allows. Mm -hmm. Here, I had him make you a few things for all that travel. Good of you. Thanks. So yeah, because this is Quicksilver Ore, I think that's why the authors of the unofficial patch said it can't be an ebony ore mine, but whatever. Don't forget us if you need supplies for your journey. Uh, this is all still marked as steel. All right, but... You here for lessons like Ingen? Or did uh, you wish to This buy? is all still marked as steel, and that is a bug. In this case, the unofficial patch would fix that, that you can take these things for free after you befriended those guys. I think so, at least. Oh well. Not that we need any of that, but it would give us some money. Right? Um, so yeah, I'm using the uh, quick loot mod that shows up here and uh, in case you've wondered if you've seen I'm still using Skyrim 1.5.80 that is the reason but good news I just saw there is a beta for a version 2.0 of that mod rewritten from the ground up and uh, for my next playthrough, I will see if I can use that and upgrade my Skyrim. Okay, we're not going into the bunkhouse, I just want to get out of the rain and sign off. These are the adventures of Aleka, the Hooning Shield Maiden. Ah, yes. And now I know. Last time. After the old golden thing, I wanted to discover another place near there, but I didn't. So, we'll go back there um, sometime soon, I guess, and find the Hounding Shrine. But that is for next time. So, if you like this video, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.